All right, before you clock in to work today, allow me to piss you off with two things that's going to help you. That sounds confusing, right? But I don't want you to go to work all happy about the wrong stuff. So I have one thing right here. All right, so what is a plantation? A plantation is an estate which crops such as coffee, sugar, tobacco, are cultivated by resident labor. Okay, so you're like, well, David, I don't do coffee, sugar, or tobacco, but you might work in some type of warehouse stocking, doing one of those things like that. It's the exact same thing. Now, watch this. Be, and what, you're going to be shocked by number two. So this is not what I'm talking about. I'm talking about what's on the next page. What does the plantation mean in history? Look at this. A large form of a, a state in tropical blah, 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 with low wage resident laborers. So you might say, well, David, I'm not a low wage uh, worker. I got $10, $10 an hour, $20 an hour. Dude, before I quit my job, I was making almost what a doctor makes. It does not matter. You'll never make more than the person that owns the company and you deserve more than that. So the second thing that is gonna piss you off, keep watching. Look, on average, how much do employers make per employee. So this this depends on where you're at, but I just wanna show you no matter if you're making $50 an hour or whatever it is, they're making triple what the hell you're working and you're doing all the freaking work, man. That is not fair. You cannot pass a job down to your kids. You deserve more than that. The average small business actually generates a hundred grand in revenue per employee. So you deserve to start your own business. This is anti-job university where we you turn your passion into ways to cash in so you can clock out forever. When will you fill out another job application? Never. Listen, okay, so it says for larger companies, it's usually closer to 200 grand. So if you have one of those nice suit and tie corporate jobs or something like that, they're almost making 300 bucks off of you, man. I mean, $300,000, I'm sorry, but I do, there is a silver lining. I do have something awesome for you that can help you unshackle yourself from the chains of a, of a nine to five freaking job at anti-job, boom. All right, when you go to the description of this video, I'm not like them. I am going to give you seven days to $700 pay-per-call class. This is one of the easiest ways to get out of your job and never have to clock in again. And we teach one, two, three, ABC simple, even if you have no experience as being uh, an entrepreneur, okay? You're gonna get access to every freaking way in all of our real estate courses, snack pack courses, drop servicing courses, all of that, get out of your nine to five job because I know this morning when you woke up, you were feeling good because you just got a raise. But remember, that raise is still low wage, low wage, enslaved. And if you're a freaking uh, 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 intern, then you're unpaid. <laughs> That's literally slavery, no matter what you want to call it. And they're always going to make way more than you. So no matter how much you're making and you're happy with a mediocre existence, God didn't make you to be mediocre. You're special. And the same way they went after their dreams and started hiring you, you can go after your dreams and hire some damn body else to do all the work too and make all the damn money. You deserve that, okay? So I want you to go to the description of this video. You know what the description of the video looks like. This area, like right up in here. It's gonna be a link. This is not my channel, but it's gonna be a link under this video and it's gonna take you to where you can sign up a free trial and it's going to give you every single one of our entrepreneur courses. We're gonna transfer it over to you where you can get started immediately, instantaneously. You can start on your freaking break because I know you still got a clock in today, right? Unless you have reserves and money saved up, then I will quit that immediately. I walked off the job immediately. I was allergic to clocking in and nobody can make me clock. All right, so that's how you have to be. Remember, you can't pass down a job. And if you have a nine to five job, no matter how much you're making right now, it ain't all about YOLO. It ain't about you only live once because guess what? Your next generation, when you have kids and all of that, you're setting them up to have to deal with all the same financial stresses and crap that you dealt with. But if you build a business like what we teach you to do inside these uh classes in here then your kids have a fighting chance to be the one hiring in the next damn generation instead of filling out applications and pleading to be a damn all right love you guys and i was just looking after you see you guys in the next one